The bronze tonight to Roger Clemens. Named in the Mitchell Report as a steroid and testosterone user, he is not suing baseball, which promulgated the claims, but rather its witness against him. His former personal trainer, Brian McNamee, only a cynic would suggest Clemens sued McNamee and not baseball because baseball has deeper pockets with which to defend his suit, while McNamee barely has pants. Our runner-up, Dr. Phil, insists his visit to Britney Spears while she was hospitalized against her will was at the request of concerned family members. His people spent the weekend promoting an episode of his TV show based on the problems of Britney Spears. Just a coincidence that two news organizations are reporting Spears angrily kicked Phil out of her hospital room. But our winner? Wow, it's Bill O'Knight. He blasted John Edwards for noting in Iowa that 200,000 vets sleep each night under bridges and on grates. Quoting Bill O, the only thing sleeping under a bridge is that guy's brain. Ten million illegal alien workers are sending billions of dollars back home, and Edwards is running around saying nobody has any money. Seriously. First off, Lou Dobbs going to kick your backside for working his side of the street. Secondly, it's 200,000 tonight. Over the course of a year, the Veterans Administration says 336,000 vets will be homeless on and off. Why don't you try changing positions with one of them, Bill? See how long you last, then run your mouth about Edwards. The over-under on that, by the way, would be three minutes. Bill Orley, tonight's worst person in the world!